Good morning and welcome back to my channel, Fit Me Plus 3. I am so excited because we have been looking for a canopy slash corp carport, excuse me, option for this part of our backyard right here, which is in California, our garages are detached. And so we have this big empty space and we have a lot of gym equipment and a lot of gym things that we've just acquired in the last couple of months, actually almost the last year because of COVID and being able to exercise at home. But we've been having the hardest time finding this canopy that we knew we wanted that's great quality because um, we know people that have it and we, and Costco has been sold out forever. So this last week we got notification that the carport is in so today we are going to put it together because you can see our garage here is crazy and there's just so much in it the treadmill the other working attire say hi babe <laughs> he's just here to put it together um but this needs to be empty because there's a lot of other things that actually need to go in here so we need to pull it all out but it needs to be under a canopy so this empty space today is going to be canopied carported, whatever you want to call it, but I'm excited. So I hope you guys enjoy watching. This is part one. We are building an outdoor home gym. So let's do it. Good morning everybody. So the canopy is done and I thought that I might give you a little tour. So this is the outside. Obviously you guys saw us put it together up against our water closet. As you can see here, my husband had to manipulate it a little bit because our garage door opens out. It's not a rolling garage door. So unfortunately, um, it was running into part of the canopy and we had to take one of the poles off, but he's really good about doing stuff like that. So I'm um, gonna take you inside, show you. Um, so this is the inside. I mean, it's waterproof aside from that little hole right there, but we have a, run, a rain gutter solution for that. So I think we're gonna be okay. Um, but so the canopy itself has two windows over here. This is a full side wall. It's up against our neighbors and the, the door that's right, or excuse me, the wall that's right there. This is the part that's up against the garage. Like I said, we have the run, rain gutters to make sure that the rain goes to different parts of the backyard. So it doesn't try to deliberately come through here. Obviously it's fully roofed, has an entire roof, which is nice because we just don't have to worry about it. On this side here, we have two windows and then this is our door. So as you saw in the video as we were putting it up, this um, opens up and it will stay up. We were expecting some rain today. Um, so that was why we put it down to test and see exactly how it was going to do because our theory is that when we know it's going to rain, we will come out and close the door, make sure everything's zipped up and make sure everything's ready to go. But then when it's not raining, we'll just leave the door open because it's easier to come in and come out. So obviously on this side where the, the solid door is, it opens on both sides and this is where the gate goes out into our driveway. Um, so we don't really have the equipment in here yet. This is where the treadmill is probably going to go. My husband's going to build like a 
um, a platform for it, obviously, because it can't just sit on the ground. We don't want it to get wet. We already have a cover solution for it. We brought the rest of the workout gear out already, put it on a pallet so it's suspended. I mean, we've got mats, we've got, um, excuse me, we've got our plyo box, we've got weight vests, slam balls, yoga, ba yoga bars, we've got our balance ball we haven't quite opened yet, we've got some dumbbells, our barbell is on the way um, with our weights, so we've got our barbell bell, we have tons of like ankle weights and stuff, our plyo box has some hooks on it so we can use it, and then we have our stepper. So we've got plenty of stuff, we're ready. <laughs> I don't know what we're waiting for. Um, and then the only other thing that we moved out here, we decided that all the kids' toys would live out here. We brought everything out. It's already gotten a little crazy, so we're going to have to figure out how to keep this um, as closed and as easy as possible. But it just takes it out of the garage. It's not as messy. Um, the boys were kind of, the boys and the baby just kind of had their stuff thrown in a corner, which was really difficult to get in and get out and to just use the garage it's intended. So. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed watching us put it together. We're going to come back and do another video to show you as we put in the gym equipment and how it continues to grow to be an outdoor gym for our family to stay fit and to stay active and to just have options. So thank you as always for watching. We appreciate you. Don't forget to like and subscribe and come back for part two. We'll see you soon. Bye-bye.